What's going on, everybody? I'm so excited to have you back. Per viewer request, today I will be going over the difference between 2XL and 2XLT. Let's get started. So today's video, I'm gonna be showcasing two Duluth trading shirts. If you've been on my channel before, you know that I talk about Duluth a lot. It's my favorite place to shop as a big and tall person. It's the only place that I can go into. I, I'm 6'10", 340 pounds. It's the only place that I can go into that I know that if I like it in that style, they have it in my size. It is so refreshing to be able to do that. The one thing they don't have is pants. I need a 38 inch inseam and then they only go up to 36. So, and I already talked to customer service, so they're working on it, don't you worry. But one thing that Duluth is really, really good about is making clothing for bigger, huskier guys. So for these two shirts, uh, this is Duluth's barbecue shirts um, that I put in my Father's Day video a couple of days ago. Um, so be sure to check that out. Um, but this is gonna be a, a little bit more in-depth video on the difference between the actual sizing. So I ordered a 2XL version and a 2XLT version. And the reason you wanna go 2XLT or XLT or LT, 3XLT, whatever, a lot of times as a bigger person, and I'm sure most bigger people already are aware of this, like if you, if a 2XL isn't long enough, you usually have to buy a 3XL for it to be long enough. Uh, and then it's too wide and it just drapes off you, you know, like way too loose. Um, so the beauty of 2XLT is it takes that 2XL um, size and actually just extends the length of it. So super handy for if you need to tuck your shirt in or just look like a normal person with a normal shirt on. That's the biggest thing. For years, I always had to endure mocking because my shirts weren't long enough. I love my mother, but goodness gracious, she would give me a hard time. Totally kidding. Um, but let's get started and take a look at the difference between these things. Okay, so now I'm gonna showcase the actual length difference between a 2XL shirt and a 2XLT. For starters, we will start out with the 2XL. One thing you have to keep in, one thing you have to keep in mind whenever you're buying shirts like this is if you're a bit more round, like I am. I got a thick trunk, so I gotta make up for it. Okay, there you have it. This is the length. This is what it looks like. Um, my belt line is like right here. This thing barely goes down below my belt line. And I wore this white t-shirt underneath so you can actually see that it is like right there. There is no tucking this in. Like this, this to get tucked in, there's nothing there for it to actually stay. So um, this is why you have to get that extra length. So hopefully, so now let's check out the 2XLT. Keep in mind from the collar here, this has seven buttons all the way down to the bottom. The 2XLT has eight buttons. So let's see how much of a difference that actually makes. Okay, let's get the 2XLT on and take a look at it. <laughs> Forgot to take this off. So here is the 2XLT. You can notice that it's way longer. Here's my belt line. I mean, this thing has a good, like four inches past my belt line, you can actually tuck these shirts in, which is a big deal. So, and like I said a second ago, this has eight buttons from top to bottom, and that bottom button falls just above my belt line. So that shows you how low this actually goes. The other button on the 2XO actually went down to about my navel. See where this button is? That's where the bottom button was in the 2XL. Uh, and then this one goes down even further. This showcases the difference between 2XL and 2XLT and why you've got to have that extra long shirt. So thank you so much for viewing today. I hope it was helpful for you to actually see the difference in the link to the two shirts. Hopefully this helps if you're buying clothes for someone that's big and tall or if you're buying them for yourself. Um, there are options out there and they're starting to become a little bit more mainstream. Thank the Lord. So thanks so much for your time today. Uh, I would love for you to subscribe and also click that little bell icon. Uh, I come out with videos every Thursday at 9 a.m. and Sunday at one o'clock in the afternoon central time. Um, so look for that those videos there. Also, leave some comments below on what you would like to see me review. This size comparison was because of a viewer that wanted me to go over that. 
and I would love to continue doing that. So please leave a, a comment below on what you'd like to see, uh, and I will make sure to do that. So thanks so much for watching. It's really been a pleasure having you here, and I can't wait to see you next time. Again, Corey from Freaky Tall Reviews. Until next time.